Today we are going to review the UV curing box from Geetech. My name is Bashar and this is Stock 3D Printing. Okay, I get this for uh, $55 dollar, you, Canadian dollars. I don't know how much that will be. I think that will be 40 or 40 dollars us dollars let's see what's inside the box okay okay foam he's that oh that's that cool thank you thank you nice this is like a small card okay this is uh join the key tech print user club facebook group uh, that's cute i like that and the manual look at that manual it's look nice not bad what is that user product okay we'll see that later and this one piece I have a number in it five okay and this the base Okay, that's cool. And think those the light power. I think this is like the timer and the start and stop. I think this is the things to connect it. Hmm. Screw. Well, I think that everything in the box. Okay, it's time for me to assemble it. Okay, now we're done with the assemble was uh, I was it easy it's nothing complicated the most thing bother me take me time is to move the wrap from the correct but in general was simple just follow the instruction now what I did or what I'm planning to sit I'm gonna compare this one with the the NQP curing and wash uh, station I have it and I have the review before if you like visit that uh, that uh, video and I'm gonna compare with them now I print two wallet from thanks both those uh, from same uh, file and I'm gonna put the three minutes for this guy in the GTEC and I'm gonna try it in the in cubic for another three minutes and we'll see how the result come out now you can see it's really it's just strong I turn off all the the, the, the lights to see it how uh, it's look the, the the light is strong but uh, it really was small small light uh, fine I'm just gonna put the flash the light back okay now it's beeping when it's hit five second and we're good look at this now let's see what's gonna happen oh well, that look good now like you can see those only the light you have you know but uh let's see i'm gonna see how they look compare this is the GTEC. this is the Encupic. well I see them both of them is good and both of them look fine for me maybe the GTEC still you can see there's some area need to uh, get cure more but I use three minutes and three minutes but for the price you pay for it it's, it's look good definitely they look good uh, I can feel like this guy the Encupic was cure more but as a price wise it's still really good maybe if i put it for more time will make a difference i will give it a try and uh, cure it more and let's see what's gonna come out okay i get for another minutes and i don't know now is it cure more yeah i think now i can feel like it's get better now you can see it it's get dry all that the eyes and all these stuff but definitely it's really 
for the amount of the price it's really impressed i really like it in general i don't see a big difference you can tell they're like one of them i don't know this may be this is look bitter but both of them look for me uh good like i'm not the expert in uh, resin i'm still learning i don't know which one you guys think is good uh gitech or Encubic. leave me that in the comment now before i go or let uh done my video or review for today i just want to touch one thing i was really wishing to have this have this is like a middle reflection because in cubic they have this in in middle uh or they have like a, i don't know what that material they used for the plate and that reflect that light i was i think that if they have that that would be good at, but in general i like it to have that sensor for a stop blade and the light and the results coming out beautiful uh that review for me today for the gita curing box if you like my video please don't forget to subscribe hit like and turn off the notification and see you in the next video and keep printing